Hey everybody, uh, Coach Julia here. Um, people also call me Jules, so um, either or works. Uh, I just wanted to make a quick video kind of explaining to you all, um, you know, a little bit about me and my story with Beachbody. Um, I know you guys are in the open house right now and I hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, hopefully you have learned a little bit about what we do as coaches and um, can maybe see how that can, um, you know, be something for you down the line. Um, so, like I said, I'm Coach Julia. I have been here for um, two years now. Um, how I stumbled upon Beachbody is kind of a funny story. So, for me, I remember um, specifically one late night watching an infomercial, and I was with somebody, and T25 came on, and I just remember Shanti, you know, freaking out like he does, like, he, you know, hard, hardcore workout. And I remember specifically saying to the person I was with, I would never do that. That looks so hard. Um, a little bit about me, too, is I like to work out. I feel like I was a fit person before Beachbody. I would go to the gym some days at 5.30 in the morning in the freezing cold Iowa weather, and, you know, I'd get a workout in. Um, but for me, I never was able to see really results. It was more just the fact that, like, it was a routine that I would do. I, I didn't do it. I wasn't seeing the results that I was wanting to get, but I would just do it because it made me feel good. Um, so when that commercial came on, it was funny that I just thought like that looked really hard. And, you know, so for me, I was more of like, I would go to the gym and I would do the elliptical and, um, do some weights. And I worked out with my mom's trainer every once in a while, but so I knew how to work out, but that just looked really hard. So I just thought I would never do something like that. And, uh, funny, I think it was like the next day or like the next couple of days after that, I remember, um, my coach now, Kayla, posted um, a video of her doing T25 on her Instagram, and I was like, "No way!" Um, you know, she she has she's doing this program. Um, if you guys don't know Kayla, she is uh, a DJ on SiriusXM Radio. She is on Octane, and it's one of my personal favorite channels to listen to. Been listening to it, um, you know, now for long time and back then I just remember Kayla was I mean even now she's my she was my role model and I also thought I wanted to get into radio I thought I would be a promotional type of you know going to the promotional field and you know sell tickets to concerts and work with bands I, I think that would that would have been so cool um, I actually started my own promotions company back in the day with my younger brother and um, I just remember looking up to Kayla like you know that's that's who I want to be so when I saw that she was doing that and I, I was just blown away and I, was, I commented right away and I was like oh my gosh I want to do that and I didn't really think about it I didn't think she'd actually comment back or you know anything you know it's just Instagram but sure enough, she commented back and said to email her, and that was a huge thing. I was like, whoa, she responded, and um, turns out, long story short, you know, we got on the phone. She asked me about what I was doing and, you know, what I was struggling with, and, you know, we talked about all that, and um, it, was, it wasn't until the second phone call I heard about, you know, a couple programs that she thought might be good for me, um, and she talked to me about Shakeology, and um, I was just, you know, so, um, I don't even know the right word, not humbled. I was just amazed that she was on the phone talking to me. Um, this girl who went up to her and talked to her at the last, um, event or concert that we were at. And I actually like asked to take her picture with me because I was trying to get an internship with Sirius XM Octane. And I just, so it's just funny that like my role model was talking to me on the phone. I thought that was pretty crazy. Um, so, I ended up deciding to go ahead and uh, purchase the T20, T25 with Shakeology. Um, she actually talked me, not talked me into, uh, she actually just told me about the opportunity of coaching and, you know, you can get a little bit discounted um, products and, you know, you know, to make it a little cheaper. I was a college kid. Uh, I wasn't really excited to pay the 130, you know, 140, whatever it is now, um, a month, to, uh, you know, for my stuff. So I tried it out for a month and I loved it. I was in a challenge group uh, with her coach, Paul, and I would check in every day. I loved, you know, the community um, that we had with Beachbody and within the challenge group. And I saw great results like already within the first month. So I knew I was going to be doing this again. Um, I'm trying to think like, if I'm trying to think, you know, what is the you know, the thing that uh, clicked in me that I knew I wanted to do the coaching opportunity. Um, 
the one, the few things that I um, came up with, you know, I, I knew how, how this company worked. I had previously worked, um, you know, I was selling those the Scentsy warmers. I actually tried another shake product, um, Body by Vi, um, before Beach Body and Shakeology. And, you know, I obviously wasn't drinking Body by Vi anymore. I didn't see results like I did with Shakeology. Um, so, but I knew how the, these opportunities work and I know how this business um, runs. So, um, you know, prior, you know, even though I know that like my family sometimes doesn't always like get excited that I jump into these opportunities, it's something that I'm not scared of anymore. Like I know how it works and um, it's exciting and I see opportunity in it. So I knew that like that might be something that I want to pursue. Um, I also just, I just knew that I wanted, you know, Kayla to be proud of me uh, for working my business and, you know, running, you know, challenge groups and continuing, you know, being a coach and, um, you know, drinking the products and working out. And I, I mean, not to say that I didn't love all of the programs and the Shakeology and stuff, but I really wanted, you know, my role model to be proud of me. And that being said, you know, even myself, I wanted to, you know, show myself that I could do something. I, you know, quit body by Vi. I really wasn't doing the sensey thing anymore. And I just was always one of those people that quit things. So, for me to still be doing this two years later, um, and I know I'm not quitting, that's just like even more um, fuel to the fire, you know. So I made myself proud, and I feel like I'm making Kayla proud, so that's always a good thing. Um, and I wanted to prove others that I could do this, you know. Like I said, my parents don't really totally understand this opportunity and understand what I'm doing. Um, I think they're slowly getting it, but I want to show others that I'm not a, I'm not a quitter, and this is this is serious. This is my life and I'm going to do this, you know? So, um, I also wanted to pay it forward. You know, I, you know, three months in or 60 days into my 225 after I finished, I, you know, I lost six pounds and eight and a half inches, which was amazing. I've never seen, um, that weight come off before. I have been told, um, by family members sometimes even like, you know, maybe you're just not supposed to lose, you know, be that way. Maybe you're not supposed to be at that um, level, you know, or be at that weight. And that made me so mad. That actually, like, motivated me even more to finish T25, to drink my shake every day, to eat healthier, um, and to still do this. You know, I I did hit that weight that I didn't think I was ever going to hit. So, um, you know, it is possible. Um, and I wanted to pay it forward, you know, with uh, showing other people that it is possible. Um, and I, um, you know, I definitely love this opportunity. It's, it's being a college kid, I'm graduating soon. I, I now know that like, this is my, I used to think it was a backup plan. And I used to think, well, you know, if I don't find, you know, the, the highest paying job right away after, like after college, you know, this will be the backup plan to do things that I might not be able to buy because of, you know, parents funds, you know, aren't always there. Um, but now I, I did go full time. Um, I haven't graduated yet, so I did just quit like a part time job. Um, I haven't quit, you know, obviously a full time job. I haven't had a full time job yet, but this is my new full time thing, and um, I am super excited to see where it goes and to put as 110% into it. Um, so, you know, I will be um, moving soon, and I'm kind of, you know, I don't need, I'm not. I'm not going to be getting support from my family anymore. Um, growing up uh, with a, you know, well-off family, like you get a lot of help, um, and that's something I took advantage of for a long time. Um, and I, you know, was slowly starting to realize, like, holy cow, I have to do this on my own now. And um, Beachbody is that thing that's going to keep me um, on track and keep me able to live the life that I want to live. So. Um, so that's a little bit about me. Um, I'm, you know, excited to show this opportunity to you all and, you know, to feel free to ask me any questions, um, you know, or if you have any, um, thing you can relate to, let me know. Um, one takeaway I want you guys to walk away with, um, is, you know, don't let opportunities like this pass you by. Um, you know, I would totally regret if I didn't, um, you know, take on the opportunity of being a coach like I, you know, like I'm doing now. It's uh, really changed my life and I've made the best of friends um, in this, you know, in this crazy life that I have now. Um, 
almost all of my friends are in Beachbody somehow, whether they're just drinking Shakeology or um, maybe that you know that they're a coach. Um, and you know, I wanted to be a part of something, and I never felt like the cool kid that fit in anywhere, and I fit in somewhere now. So. Um, you know, don't let that opportunity pass you by. So hopefully we'll see you guys um, at the end of this group, um, you know, in the coaching uh, pages and look forward to meeting you all then. Bye guys.